Hello and welcome to the Indian Bee. Let's pause for a moment of silence before starting the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Last night in sports, Lady Indians welcomed in, in a tough Union County squad in volleyball. The ladies took the Patriots in a long first set, 32-30, to 30, but then the Patriots came right back and were able to win in the next three sets, giving the Lady Indians their first loss of the season. And congratulations goes out to Carly Riss Miller as she eclipsed the, her 1,000th assist mark for her high school career. The girls travel next to Winchester for another tough conference matchup. Tonight, the Indians football team are once again at home and look to get their first one of the year against Oldenburg Academy. Kickoff is at 7 p.m. Good luck to the Indians. Attention all senior fall athletes. Miss A will be taking pictures for your senior banners on Monday after school in the KISS studio. Athletes need to bring with them football, volleyball, palms, and tennis rackets. Athletes need to be in full uniform. There will be no cost to the athletes. Check your email for specific times for your sports. Please be on time Monday. The first FFA meeting of the year is Monday, August 30th in Mr. Smith's room. All students in grades 7 through 12 are welcome. They will talk about upcoming acti FFA activities and there will be door prizes and food. Yo, what up guys? It's Pink Horn back with the weather. 74 degrees out, not too bad. Tonight's nice, gonna get a little hotter, maybe a chance of rain. My bus and umbrella hat is gonna protect me from the rain. Noise. <laughs> Today is Friday, August 27th. On this day in history, in 1859, the first successful oil well was drilled near Titusville, Pennsylvania by Edwin Drake. In 1928, 16 died in New York City subway, the city's second work accident. In 1955, the Guinness Book of World Records was published. Also, in 1978, Reds, Joe Morgan was first major leaguer to hit 200 home runs and at 500 stolen bases. All of this happened on this day in history, August 27th. Today is Bree's birthday. 